Hi there, my name is Lauren Hope Glory. I'm the CEO of Moving On TV. It's lovely to be here. Um, lately, I'm getting a lot of people asking me about depression. Um, in the lockdown in particular, um, people are starting to experience depression, sadness, and I have great techniques that I use that actually work. And so in this program, I'm going to be giving you different techniques to help you to use um, if you're low or depressed. Um, and I hope it really helps you because they do work for me. Uh, you can always contact me at lauren.movingontheatre at gmail.com. lauren.movingontheatre at gmail.com. Or you can get me on Facebook on Moving On TV, Twitter Moving On TV. Uh, call me on 07437-532-798. So here we go. Depression. Thank you. Right, depression. Let's look at the word depression first. What does it mean to be depressed? Well, to me, the word means to be pushed down to depress, to push down, to block, okay? And um, to me, what it means as well is that it could be that you're blocking and pushing down a lot of anger, a lot of rage, a lot of frustration, or a lot of fear, or a combination of all these emotions. And because they haven't been dealt properly in your life, they've turned into this thing we call depression. So you've kind of denied them, whether you knew you were or whether it's just happened through your life. And so it gets to a point where you get really, really low and sad and you get depressed where you lose interest in life. There can be different variations of depression. You can go into apathy, you want to cry a lot. Um, we'll look at that as well, is the, the uh, reaction of crying a lot at the moment, particularly men that are crying a lot. But we'll look at that in another section. So that's what I feel the first thing is to, to think about. Depression, as I say, is when everything has been pushed down, <clears throat> particularly if you're a man and you haven't had a, an experience of crying, you haven't been allowed to express your crying, your tears, to bring everything up. Because the heart is opening, we're in a process of the heart opening, you're going to start feeling that these emotions want to come up. And at times you're gonna feel sad, you're gonna feel confused, you're gonna have all of this turmoil go on inside you. So that to me is the first step to understanding what this may be. Now, the other thing about depression is that you, you need to acknowledge it. It's the same as everything else. What you resist persists. So if you do not acknowledge and accept and validate the state you're in, you cannot move away from it. You cannot grow. You cannot have an experience of, of, of actually getting past it. So you need to acknowledge and say, look, I feel depressed, I feel sad, I wonder what this is. Explore it and don't push it away. Just acknowledge it the same way as in the 12 steps. Um, an, an addict needs to accept the addiction first. So do not go into denial, okay? So once you've got that, and you're out of denial, you feel this sadness, you feel that you want to cry, you need to honor that. You need to honor it and you need to give yourself the space to do that. Let the tears flow. Um, give yourself the space and the respect and the dignity. You have a right to, for these feelings to come up, okay? And if you start getting this voice in your head, like I do some, sometimes of someone saying, oh, you don't have a right to feel these feelings or whatever, then you just say, okay, thank you. I understand, I get the message. But yes, I do have a right to feel these feelings. This is my life, this is my body, and this is how I want to deal with it. And this is how I deal with it. And this is why I can move forward and get on with my life and do the things I love with depression and without medication, okay? And the next thing you wanna make sure that you do, which is so important, drink 
water. You have to drink gallons and gallons of water because if you're not drinking and you're not hydrated, then there's chances the, the mind can get blocked. Uh, you can get pain in the body as well, but you can get depressed. Your brain is not functioning properly. Your blood sugar is not functioning proper, properly. So you need to take care of that. Drink water. Very, very important. Uh, the next thing is we'll look at HALT, which is don't get too hungry. That's what I said about your blood sugar. Keep your blood sugar balanced. Make sure it's balanced. Make sure you're eating through the day. You're eating fruit. Nuts uh, are great, like Brazil nuts are great. Um, fruits, if you need to, you know, if the red, weather is warm, give yourself an ice cream, you know. Give yourself something that you love, but make sure you're eating healthy foods. Lots of salads, lots of fruit, lots of nuts. Uh, if you're not a vegan, make sure you have a good meal. Have a good breakfast. Make sure you eat properly because you must keep your blood sugar on the level. So this is halt. Don't get too angry. So as I said, it could be that you're pushing down your anger. So make sure that you have an outlet. So either hits, cushions, or go into a rage room and scream and shout, let it all out. <laughs> Try to get it out in a healthy way and don't take it out on yourself and others. You know, taking it out on yourself is self-sabotage and all sorts of things, you know, destroying your own inner peace then don't get too lonely. Now we're living in a lockdown and loneliness is a big thing. And I'm hoping that some people that are lonely will watch this. Make sure you pick up the phone, you ring people, contact on Facebook, on social media, on Zoom, keep something going. People love you, people care. There's a lot of wonderful, wonderful people out there. And if you get too lonely, then please PM me on Facebook, okay? Find me, Lauren Ottewell, O T T E W I W L. Don't get too lonely. Or contact me through Moving On TV or Moving On Theatre. And don't get too tired. Tiredness kills. You need to sleep. You need to replenish your cells. Also keeps you very healthy. Um, okay, this is so important. Now, another point, do not watch TV. Whatever you do, do not watch TV. No, 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 no. Do not watch mainstream media because that will make you depressed so quickly, take your hope away from you and you won't function at all. So cut the TV out of your life. If you're living in a house where the TV is on, go out, get away, go to your room, listen to music, meditate, uh, read something positive. Other stuff you can do that I do. As I say, you acknowledge, you validate, you eat properly, you don't watch TV. Be careful of what you watch on mainstream as well. If you don't want to watch the hard hitting stuff that I'm putting on, don't watch it. You're not ready. Don't watch it. Give yourself a chance to, to heal first before you watch the hard hitting stuff. Okay. Um, watch comedy, the young ones, comedy, old time comedy that used to be really funny. Father Ted, the, uh, the young ones, watch Bob and Bertha, watch, watch Fra uh, uh, Bob and Frankie, he's so funny. I'm moving on TV, there's lots of comedy on there for you. Um, do your own comedy show, talk to me, we'll do it together, you can host anything you want. Uh, be creative, paint. Uh, dance, sing, act, do yoga. Everything has been offered to you at the moment on the internet. If you don't know where that is, contact me and I'll send you some links. Um, that's it. Close your eyes. Imagine the beautiful light around you. Um, loads of light and loads of is coming into our planet and get it into you. There are other techniques I can teach you if you want to work with me. Please PM me. I'm doing everything on donations at the moment because I understand how people are living. But you can get over depression. Look at me. <laughs> I play with your pets, you know. Uh, develop um, a higher power of some kind and get into nature, guys. Sit in the sun. Vitamin D, the sun, the sun, the sun is the greatest healer of depression. So that's it. Um, I'm doing this program to help people that may be feeling low or depressed or they're waking up and they don't understand these feelings they're going through. 
love you lots please put your comments down below if you want to keep them positive because as you know uh, i do my best every day to stay well as well um and as i say keep in contact with me No, rien, rien. Oh, I love you too, Marcel. Mm, mm. Oh, bonjour, bonjour. <laughs> I want to wear my face to the audience as I would a laver. And that is why I refuse to wear the makeup and the products, not unless they are organic. Because they make me feel nude. <laughs> so, come on board, organic makeup companies, moving on TV.uk. Bonjour. No, no, no.